In this screencast we're going to highlight some of the features of TeamCity support for integration with Perforce. You can tell TeamCity about your Perforce settings by creating a VCS route. Here, when you select Perforce, you can enter the details of your Perforce server. As you'd expect, you can configure a connection to a Perforce stream, a client, or using a client mapping. For the example, we're going to set up a connection with a mapping. Once you've configured your Perforce connection, you can attach this to a build configuration. I have an existing project and I want to attach the connection to the commit build, which runs every time someone checks in a change. When I attach a specific Perforce connection to a build, I can customise exactly what is checked out, so I only check out the project or files I need for this build. So now our build is using the Perforce settings. When we check a change into Perforce, We see Team City picks up the changes and runs the build. For each build run, we can see the changes that went into that build. And even look at a diff for each file that changed. You're not limited to using only one Perforce connection for each build. If your code or tests are spread over multiple Perforce servers or depots, you can configure a build that checks out from more than one route. By editing the checkout rules, you can specify exactly which files to check out and to where. These checkout rules are one way to ensure that the files you need are in the location they should be in order to run the build. I can check my configuration was successful by manually running the build. I can see that it's going through the steps of the build and ultimately I should see that I get a successful build. TeamCity provides additional build features too. We can, for example, set a label on the revision that was used for the build. In this case, I'm going to set a candidate label on every revision that passes all the tests. So if we submit a change list into Perforce and we see that passing the build in TeamCity, Then we can see that TeamCity has added the candidate label into Perforce. So that's how TeamCity integrates with Perforce. Thanks for watching.